Hello and welcome back to Multivendor X. Today's video will be all about the product capabilities and how the vendors can upload products from their end. With Multivendor X, you have an effective and efficient product manager that lets you help vendors easily handle their products from the vendor dashboard. Let's just understand the various capabilities the admin must enable to allow the vendors to handle their products. So without any further ado, let's jump straight into the configuration process. From the admin dashboard, navigate to Multivendor X settings. Now go to product capabilities. Here we can view the various product capabilities that the vendors can perform from their dashboard once enabled by you. So do not get intimidated by the list of the settings. It is as easy as a pie. Let's start with the first option. Enable the Submit Product option if you want to allow your vendors to submit a new product from the backend and wait for your approval. Take the Publish Product option so that the vendors can directly publish their products on their site, of which we will learn later in the video. Sometimes there can be an upgrade to an existing product and the vendor wants to edit the details. You can help the vendors out by permitting them to edit their products. Allow your vendors to directly publish the re-edited products without the admin's approval by simply swiping to the right. By enabling this option, we can allow the vendors to upload any kind of media files like music, videos, images, ebook, etc. That's all about all the product capabilities. We will be discussing about the coupon capabilities once we deal with the coupon management. Now let's see from the vendor's perspective how the vendors can upload a product from their end. The products can be added in two ways. First, the vendor can add their product in the site from their respective dashboard and second, the admin can assign the products to the respective vendors. To avoid making this video super long and stuffy, we will discuss the topic in two segments. In today's tutorial, we will be discussing how the vendors can add their products on the site. So once you're here, click on Product Manager and then go to Add Product option. Now click on Create a new product. Go to Categories, click on anyone according to your choice. You can also create your very own category. Add the product name like Nike Jordan. I can already feel the sparkle on your eyes reading it. You can also add some product description. From here, you can add the product image and the image gallery. Add regular and the sale price. After all this, click on to the submit option. The uploaded product is then approved or dismissed by the admin from the admin dashboard same way the admin does for the vendor trying to register to the site. From the admin dashboard, navigate to Multivendor X and then hop on to Workboard. Once redirected to the Workboard page, you can see the products awaiting your approval under the Pending Product tab. You may either approve or may dismiss the product when the product is just not approved by you. The admin can send a product note to the vendor stating the reason for not approving it. You may also edit the product like adding a product commission or checking for errors. Once you are satisfied, you can publish it. In case you want your vendors to directly publish their product without seeking for your approval, you may simply enable the Publish Product option. Multivendor X also provides an import and export module, of which we will discuss later in the upcoming videos. With this, we have come to the end of our video. In the next part of the video, we will discuss how to assign a particular product to a vendor. If you like the tutorial, then do not forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Click on to the small red bell to get notified whenever we post a new video. Thank you for watching.